Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Journeyman series with me in... This time it's Croatia in the Euro. We end the Journeyman series already, but just to finish the Journeyman off, we are gonna play in the Euro 2024 with Croatia. Let's go! So, just to quickly tell you guys what happened. So we are the manager of the Croatia. Now we are playing in the Euro 2024. And then in our group, we have France, Scotland, and then Turkey. France is the opposition we're going to play first today. Probably the hardest opposition out of the, all three of them. So we're going to quickly look at the team for today. Because France have Mbappe, so kind of a little bit scammy a little bit. So we're going to have Levan Kovic in goal. And then Josh Cole will play a left back to be more defensive a little bit. And then... We will have Uremovic. I don't think I introduced him to you guys before. So he started at Rubin Kazan, a Croatian centre back. And he will start today ahead of. We have the likes of Bankovic. Bankovic is just too slow, so he won't start today. Sutalo, the Reading centre back in real life is Juventus. Yep. Uh, I just think that Uremovic is a little bit better. So Uremovic. <laughs> Already got stuck with him. Uremovic will start alongside Kalidaka. And then we will have Batalek at right back. And then Brozovic and Kovacic in the midfield. Obviously, Ivan Nusic, center attacking midfielder. Vlasic at left wing. And then Brekalo, who got injured at our first friendly against, um, who was it? Peru. But he's back today, just not as fit as I want him to be. But he has to start. This is the toughest opposition he has to play. And then Barisic also got an injury like before joining us from the international break uh, from the club football. But his match condition is okay, just match Shamless, not the greatest. But hopefully, we can just get a draw. That That's enough for me today. So, let's just quickly look at what else we can do. Maybe we will try to like change the left back to be more defensive a little bit later. We're just gonna go with our normal tactic first. Uh, pull the line out, yep. That's something we need to pay attention to because Mbappe is so fast. And then change during the game. Let's go in Euro. So here's how France will line up later. Mbappe starting. Okay, so we're gonna quickly change something up. <laughs> this is not great already, is it? Um, can Brekal play as a left winger? He will cut inside from left wing. Oh god, okay. Vlasic, uh, Vlasic. Vlasic on the right. He will cut inside from left wing as well. Ivan Vlasic. Can you place the left mid? He also will cut inside from left wing. Oh, okay. And Bobby will attack down on the right. Uh, their right or left. So we're going to put Josh Cole as fullback on support only. Not that attacking. And then... Oh god. We need someone that can like hold a whiff for us there. Let's think. Uh, we're gonna play Vlasic as the inverted winger rather than um, inside forward. Okay, that's the only changes. Let's go. Oh, first free kick. Oh my god. Ready to go 1 0 down so early at 6 minutes. Antoine Griezmann with the goal. Free kick assist by Thomas Lemar. It's a very simple goal. Oh, it's just messy defending. Oh no. So let's just quickly go through the front team. We have Loris in goal. Oh my god. Okay, it's our highlight. Okay, Josh Cole, come on. Do something. Brissage. Get there. Yes, okay. Kovacic in midfield. Switch our way to Ivan Use the whiff. Use the whiff. Yes, Brekalo. Cuts it, up. Cuts it back. Uh, Why well, you didn't cross it? Ivan Nusic. Why you pass it out, Kovacic? Ivan Nusic, cut it back! My god, we should at least get it on target there. Okay, we back and looking at the team. We have Hernandez, left back, Laporte and Tony Boy at centre back. Benjamin Pavard at right back. Kamavinga and Dombele at centre back. And then Griezmann, striker. Hassan Moua at centre, attacking midfielder. And then uh, Lemar at left wing, and Mbappe at right wing. And then here comes the counter attack from France. Okay, that's terrible decision by Lemar there. Good for us. Okay, a long throw for us. 
God, 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 God. Ah, Loris comes out and claim it. Okay. Win it, win it, just call. Yes. God, yes. Hey, that's Blast Edge, okay. <laughs> Could confuse with them a little bit. Oh my god, why we keep shooting from the Y angles? Why is she playing better? I'm, I'm surprised, okay. France has actually like, been dominated by us. We have more shots and more possession as well. God, God. <sighs> Loris comes out and claim it again. Oh my god, come on boys, come on, we're playing well, just don't get counter-attacked by France, I guess. Okay, here comes Mbappe. Uh, like, he wins player of the year, this thing, I think. Which is the Ballon d'Or. Barisic pressuring Loris, force him out. Lassage. Oh god, oh god, okay, here comes the problem. There we go, Mbappe. Saved by Livankovic. Oh my god, that's the danger of Mbappe like running in behind because he's just too quick. Lamar of the corner. Levankovic claims it. Okay. It's a long throw by Batalek. Oh no one's get there. Uh, but oh my god, no, we're gonna get caught on attack. Someone bring him down, please. Great tackle by Kalidaka, uh, but and Dombele run away with it. Brisic, ah, uh, then intercept the ball. Okay, France rebuilding from the back. Pass it back all the way to Loris. Here go Loris. Clear it up. Gone intercept. Yes, Ricardo. Gone. Gone. Brisic get in position. Get in position. <sighs> of course, he's gonna shoot himself. Save by the goalkeeper. Uh, Loris. So we're gonna get a corner. Gone. 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 Oh. Lasage. Outside the box. Lasage. Cross it. Got taco by Ndombele. And the highlight end there. We're gonna enter half time 1 0 now. We're playing okay, I guess. Like 50, almost 50 50 percent of the possession, but we have more shots. Uh, just gonna do one change, I think, because we are already 1 0 now. I think let's just go attacking straight away. So we're gonna bring on Jira left back and then go full back on attack and then Blasage inverter wing inside forward on support. That's the only changes I think. Let's go. Okay, break out with a corner. God. Oh, and don't believe wins the ball. Gonna play it down to Hassam Oa. Thank God Hassam Oa is not the quickest, but but Tolex defending this is not the best at defending. Shit, shit, shit. Levankovic save us. Okay. It's a warning sign. Hassam Oa is not the quickest, but Batolex do didn't manage to catch him. Lamar with the corner. Swings it in. Oh, I was gonna pick up the loose ball. Okay, great defending by Brekalo, but Brekalo is like dying his fitness. Oh, not Brekalo, it's Ivan Uh 60 plus minutes. Um, What can we do? Brekalo is our, our best winger, so no way he's coming off. Um, Brozovic is surprisingly having a bad game. Don't know why. We're gonna take him off, I think. Let's just check the stats of Brozovic. Like, what does he do wrong? Passing bad. 81% passing completion ratio. 0% tackle worn. 0% heading worn. That's probably why. Uh, okay. I think we're gonna take him off for. Ulan? Let me just check on the stats really quickly. Uh, oh, we're gonna bring on Hasalic. Also, can. Hasalic, Hasalic compared to Bulan. That's deep line playmaker. On support, on support, not on defend. On support. Mm. Bulan's a little bit better. How about Marco Rock though, let's think. Marco Rock, compare him with... Um, I forgot to tell you guys I in the end didn't pick Basic because I think Basic is not good enough in the end in my opinion. I really checked the stats, I compare them properly and then I decided not to take um, Basic. So Basic is left at home. And Russia looking, watching us playing. Um, better passing, better technique. But Bulan got better tackling. Yeah, Bulan's the man. Bulan's gonna come on. Bulan's gonna come on as deep line playmaker. 
Okay, we're gonna leave ones up. Come on, boys, come on. Should we go more attacking? That's the question. Uh, no, we're gonna keep going like this, but just in case, you know, things happen. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Totally, boy. It's another set piece goal we concede. <sighs> Not sure, is it like Livankovic didn't save it properly or what? I want to look at it. Livankovic, man. In the family, he, he's really like making mistakes, you know. Shit, man. I might consider dropping him next game then. Like, he cannot do things like this against like teams like France. Oh, God. We're going to go very attacking. Like, we're losing two. But the goal difference might be important. We're just going to keep it like this first, I guess. Since we are losing, we're going to take off Brecalo to rest him for the next game. So, we're going to bring on Lof Rich, the backup winger for us show you guys quickly but i'm gonna show you like like go through the really details coming on if not like this episode might be too long you know or we might split it into two episodes i don't know but oh my god we gonna lost our first group stage game against france i mean i expect us to lose against france but both goals are set pieces which ain't great if i'm being honest with you plus we should pick up a yellow card just before the 90 plus minutes ah uh, shit lost the first game Scotland got the win I think I'm gonna split into two episodes because we need to play two games coming up if make, that makes sense to you guys so next episode is against Scotland and Turkey unless we lost the first game then we are already then we will not do any more episodes See you next episode then. Bye.